It is a welterweight matchup between Donald Cerrone and Leon Edwards. All right, so here he is, a very accomplished striker, finally making the walk to the octagon tonight. Got to think he'll be interested, of course, in keeping this fight standing in his wheelhouse. And he's got the takedown defense to keep this fight where he wants it. No doubt he'll be looking to put on a striking clinic here tonight. This guy has ridiculous hand speed. If this fight comes to a striking exchange, he will have a distinct advantage. Well, he's a matchmaker's dream. He's been a contender in two different divisions. Here is the always active Donald Cowboy Cerrone. Outstanding striker, great submission game, and you've seen an uptick in the takedowns as well since he moved up to 170 pounds, where he has realized a whole lot of success. Donald Cowboy Cerrone, now welterweight contender, still working towards that title shot here at 170 pounds. Donald Cerrone is a well-rounded fighter with great submissions and great more time. He's extremely difficult to finish, a lot of heart, great chin, and he fights very well in the later rounds. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Cerrone is eight years his senior. The rest is roughly identical. We send it inside the octagon. We find Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Mario Yamasaki. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Air Canada Center in Toronto, Canada. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC Walkerweight Division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, holding a professional record of 15 wins, three losses. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Leon Rocky Edwards! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer, holding a professional record on. 33 wins, 10 losses, and one no contest. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Albuquerque, New Mexico, Donald Cowboy Cerrone! All right, I gave instructions to you guys in the locker room. I want you guys to follow my orders at all times. Defend yourself at all times. Touch gloves. Good luck. This is a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right now. I'm very excited. All right, ready to go with live action here from Air Canada Center in Toronto, Ontario. He blocks the shot. Cerrone gets hit with a kick. He appears largely unfazed, but he doesn't want to take too many more of those, Joe. Oh, that's a nice inside leg kick right there. And he eats a right hand there. Donald Cerrone with a ferocious leg kick. Cerrone gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up, Joe. Hit him hard with that hook. Went for the inside leg kick. Going orthodox now. 
Well, his opponent found an opening there to the body. Nice hook shot there, but as he leans forward in trying to get into his own striking range, he's going to pay the price there to the body. Got to be careful. You don't want to eat too many of those power hooks downstairs. Locks up the Muay Thai clinch. Oh, that's how you change levels, Joe. Beautiful trip to get the takedown. It looks to me like he's trying to turn towards either side. And dizzy as he looks to improve position here. And he's back to his feet. Good side for him there. Oh, head kick blocked by Edwards. Look at that, he's timing that jab. And there he swung with a haymaker. Lead kick landed there by Cerrone. Punch coming, it's blocked. That one hurt. All right, under three minutes now to go in round one. Push kick there to the body. Oh, that's a good strike there by Cowboy Cerrone. In on a double leg takedown here. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. He's putting his hands down on the thighs. He's looking to pass. And there's the double leg takedown, Joe. That's his best shot by far. Edwards' lower jaw is extremely swollen now. Big shot. Full mount. Look at this. He's out of it. Well, you got to be working off of your back. He's certainly doing so here. Nice punch. And back up again. He's got good accuracy on that jab. Wow! He's in big, big trouble here. This fight is dangerously close to being stopped. Oh, nice defense there, Joe, to block that shot. Oh! Nice leg kick. Great kicks there. Big left hand there inside. Just missed with a huge kick. Well, his opponent's got the lead now, Joe, as he lands the punch to the head. He's got to change up his striking pattern and the tempo, or he's going to... Oh! oh! He's in a lot of trouble. Oh! These are some bombs he is throwing. And he's in full guard. Good punch. Final minute. Pretty good work with the strikes here off of his back by Sharon. He's doing a great job of ground and pound here. Ripping to the body and to the head, staying busy. Well, as usual, suffocating work from the top here by Edwards. Well, he's been on his back here, but he's actually doing some pretty effective work. Joe lands a strike there from the bottom. Nicely done there by Cowboy Sharon. Oh, this is a good shot from the bottom. Edwards going to work here from the full guard. Nice combination of strikes, mixing it up pretty well here. Well, he works hard to get up again here, but he looks hurt. Blocks that strike. And that one certainly found the target. Oh! oh straight right. The oh, oh, sound for the end of round one. Oh, so there's the horn at the end of the round. He got knocked down near the end of it, saved by the bell. He will live to fight on. The question is for how long. And here, a perfectly placed punch results in a knockdown. Let's take a look at it from a different angle. Come on, my friend. Settle down. Excellent job. Deep breaths. Calm down. Very good controlling distance. Very good disengage and re-engage. Brittany Palmer holding it down for us here. Here you go, Frickle, are you ready? You ready? 
All right, second round underway. Now, starting off this round, you've got to think that the barrage that he endured in that last round is still affecting him. He's going to want to start this round off and move and avoid taking any damage. Cerrone gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. Another brutal leg kick by Cerrone. Oh, absolutely. I'm surprised he's not limping, Joe. Those leg kicks will really slow you down. Vicious leg kick by Donald Cerrone. How about that shoot? Good punches. Oh, unbelievable. That's it. That's and that's it. gonna do it. Big straight punch for the KO. Well, Joe, you knew if he landed that weapon repeatedly, it could be a short night for his opponent, but that was just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush, and the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. Let's see this again. And here it is again. Boom! Out cold. So there he is as the celebration continues. A huge knockout for him here tonight. That could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Mario Yamasaki is called to stop in this contest at 45 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Leon Rocky So there he is, the man of the moment. Certainly maximized the showcase here tonight, Joey. Gets a big win by way of the knockout. Certainly kept the judges out of it here tonight. Perhaps some bonus money is coming his way, but there will be no wiping the smile off of his face tonight. He will party deep into the night with his friends, his family. A huge knockout turned in by that man here tonight, and he has set himself up for a huge fight now moving forward inside the octagon.